guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's episode is going to be about Tom Ford's Paradiso collection, which is a teeny tiny collection that he came out with maybe a couple weeks ago. I thought I'd be able to resist purchasing these items, but I buckled and I went on to Beautylish uh, the other day and ordered these things. So I purchased three out of the four things. I got the um, cream cheek color, the cream and powder eye color, and also the uh, lip color sheer, the sheer lip color. Um, I passed on the Moisture Core lipstick because I have a bunch from last year's collection and I just never reach for them. So I thought it'd be fun to um, not only swatch these items but also do some comparison swatches with some of the things from either his previous Soleil collection or from this year's Soleil collection. So yeah, so if you're interested in finding out a little bit more about the Paradiso collection and um, hear my thoughts and opinions on these things, then just keep on watching. <laughs> All right, so um, let me talk about the cream cheek color first. It is what I have on my face today, and it is a really beautiful, rich sort of pinky coral color. It's um, fairly deep in tone, and I just think it's really beautiful. I was pleasantly surprised that once I kind of started to swirl my finger in the pan, that a gold sheen started to appear. So there's definitely a golden shift to the blush. I really enjoy it. I love cream products for the face, especially in the spring, summertime. Um, when, you know, there's a lot of sunshine out and, you know, light is reflecting off of your face and I like that sort of youthful glow <laughs> sort of radiating off your face when the sun is shining down. So I really like cream, uh, cream cheek products. Um, if you do too and you're sort of my similar coloring, I think that you'll love this because it's a really sort of healthy, um, vibrant sort of, um, perfect kind of glow. I think what I love most about this particular product is its actual shade. I think it is absolutely gorgeous. It makes me just look really, really healthy. And I think also what is um, going to be so amazing about this particular product is as I tan during the summer, I think it'll still work for me. Right now, it's a really vibrant, sort of poppy color with the gold. And then I think as, hopefully, <laughs> as I start to bronze over the summer, I think it'll continue to work really, really well with my skin tone. So if you have a similar skin tone to mine, I think you'll really love this color. It's just such a radiant, healthy glow. So let me swatch um, this color so you can see up close um, the shade. And I'm going to go ahead and do a comparison swatch with last year's Pink Sand which is a much lighter, cooler shade. It does also have a little bit of like a gold shift to it, which is quite beautiful. So there you can see the two side by side. As much as I like pink sand, I feel like the Paradiso color is a little bit more relevant for this year. It just has that kind of like bright poppy color that I feel like I'm seeing everywhere. So anyway, I'm really enjoying that and did I mention that's what I have on my face? Okay, next up is the um, sheer lip color, and it's what I have on my lips. And I really like this um, particular formula of Tom Ford's because it is very, very moisturizing. And it's not, it's actually not very sheer. I mean, it's not like, it's not like his matte lip color um, that is incredibly pigmented, you know, when you swipe that on your lips. But it's not sheer, it's not like the balms that he just came out with those teeny tiny um, like lips and boys sized white packaging bombs that he just came out with this past Soleil collection. Um, that to me is like a very sheer kind of lip color. These are pigmented. Um, I actually kind of uh, swiped it a couple times and even blotted it a little bit to kind of get a lighter sort of wash um, over my lips. And it's very comfortable on the lips. It's very moisturizing. It has his kind of vanilla-y, vanilla-y scent to it, but very, very faint um, and because I am not a fan of that scent and it normally bothers me, but it's very, very faint. Um, and it is um, a perfect pairing to the cheek color. So I really like it. Again, it gives just sort of um, enough color to my lips. It's very, you know, when I look at these colors, when I look at this collection, the only word that comes to mind is pretty. It's so pretty. It's very girly. Um, I'm actually filming this on Sunday, Easter Sunday. So it just, it's so like spring going into summer, Eastery. I feel like, you know, it's the perfect color for brunch. I'm a really big fan of this um, formula and this color. So let me go ahead and swatch this for you. 
and I wanted to compare it to last year's um, ultra rich lip color in Le Mapri, and I'm totally slaughtering that, I know. Um, this is not the same formula, but it is a color that I had in my collection that I was worried about it being too similar. But the Le Mapri color is much more coral and orangey. Um, and this particular formula, while they feel similar on the lips, is much more pigmented. Um, I don't actually have the other um, sheer lip color, the Sweet Spot color. Um, I don't know if I should get it. It looks, again, it looks like another very pretty, pretty color. If you guys have that, let me know if you think I need to have it. <clears throat> and you know what I mean when I say need. We're all friends here. And last but not least, I have the Cream and Powder Eye Color. Um, in Paradiso. I was very curious about this particular product because in the pictures that I had seen on Beautylish, um, on the Tom Ford site, the color looked very, very cool in tone and I thought, how is that going to work with the um, kind of warm, vibrant color of the, the blush and the lipstick? So um, I purchased it. I have it on my eyes today, and I am very pleasantly surprised. I know a lot of people were concerned that it looked a little bit too close to, is it Golden Peach? Yes, Golden Peach. Um, Golden Peach, it's similar, but it has a completely different feel. When I put Golden Peach on, it looks very peachy and corally um, on, my, on my particular skin tone. But when I use um, the Paradiso, it has, it definitely has a cooler tone, but it definitely warmed up as I put it on, and I thought it was actually a really beautiful complement to the cheek and the lip. Um, and you know, the more I thought about it, if they did something that was sort of like a literal translation of this color to your eyes, that may be a little bit too much. And I think the point to these cream and powder duos is that it just gives like a really pretty light wash to the lids. And I used a brush for the cream product and then I just kind of used my finger to dab the um, powder on top. And I just think it's, it's really pretty. Now, do you need both the Golden Peach and the Paradiso? Probably not. Um, even the, I feel like the Paradiso basically falls between the new Young Adonis and the Golden Peach from last year. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and swatch the Paradiso, and then I'll swatch the Golden Peach right next to it, and then the Young Adonis. And I'm also going to swatch the, um, the straight up cream color um, for eyes in Opal or Opal. Um, this is just from his regular line, not, not, the, um, not the Soleil line, and it, comes, it does not come in the white packaging, and it is just a cream color, it does not have the powder on top. This color is much cooler and lighter, but you can see that they're all, I don't know, fairly similar. I really like this new Paradiso. I think it is even more wearable than the Golden Peach. Like I said, when I put the Golden Peach on, I really have to be in the mood for some peach color on my eyes. And while it's very pretty, I think the Paradiso is an even easier color to wear than the Golden Peach because it is um, sort of not too warm and not too cool. It kind of falls right in between and the wash of color it gives is a bit more natural than the Golden Peach. So anyway, at least on my, on my skin tone. So anyway, so those are my um, thoughts on the three items that I purchased from the Paradiso collection from Tom Ford. I really enjoy them all. Again, I'm sort of a Tom Ford nut. They seem to always work on my uh, skin tone and I, they seem to be, um, I don't wanna say trendy, they always seem to be very relevant. I feel like the color options that they come out with always seem to be very relevant for the season. Um, and very relevant for whatever trends are going on at that time, but they're not like too trendy. I find them to be a little bit more timeless than that. So anyway, I hope you found this helpful. Um, if so, please give this video a thumbs up um, and please subscribe if you have not already. I would really appreciate it. And thank you so, so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.